Good day. Today I'm going to uh, read through the CRS 2611 exam of November 2022. Um, I'm doing question 15. Um, it says here, write a function, delete all, that finds and deletes all the occurrences of a given, of a given, a info. Traverse the list only once. Use the following header. And so they give you a header sample. They've got template class type, void unordered link list type, delete all, uh, const type, and delete item. All right. So this is not going to be much on the theory side of things. I'm just going to basically, um, yeah, type out the code here. So I've opened up my code blocks and I'm going to just make it a bit bigger. All right, and basically we creating this template. So um, I'm not able to copy it. So I'm going to just type it out. Um, let's go ahead and do it here like that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there. Okay. And we're just going to do it like this. Template um, class type okay and so now i don't need it i don't need it that big uh, yeah i think that's reasonable all right um and then we've got our void and we're saying an unordered link linked list okay and we've got our top and they're saying that we must use the delete all. Okay, delete all. And we've got a const of top and delete item. Okay, that that is it and so now we basically need to create the definition um, of this file so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to list the two nodes we need to know the current node and we need to know the node that's just before the current one so we do that by declaring our top as node top okay um, and then we use we use it of top since everything else is of top and we're going to call this current okay and we're going to basically say that this is the the pointer to traverse um, traverse the list okay and the next node top is gonna we're gonna call that one uh, trail trail current okay so let's copy and paste that and in over here we're gonna say trail current like that okay and this is the pointer just before the current all right so the first thing you want to do when you thinking of any list is a list can either have items in it or a list could be null and so there's no point in trying to ask the program to traverse a list that's um, got no items in it so our first um, our first case that we would do is we would see is the first null so we're going to say if um, first equals null, then we're going to say, um, so this is our first case, um, our case one, list is empty, okay, and we're going to, we're going to output we're going to say output um, cannot delete from an 
empty list. Okay. And we'll have our end line. Okay. Or else, if it's not empty, then we're going to start with our next set of code. Okay. So I'm going to put this else over here. And we're going to set current equals first. And then we're going to say, we're going to say here, um, while, while current, while current is not equal null. Then we're going to say if our current is the first, okay, I'm missing something here. And we're saying the current is set to first. Okay, then we're saying while current is not null, we should be saying if the current info, um, and so we normally would put a dot over here and say info equals, um, instead of first, it should be equals delete, delete items. Okay, delete item which you're taking from here okay then then we've got this I'm gonna leave this bracket here okay and then we say um, if current equals first then first equals first dot link okay and then we delete we delete current okay and then current equals first And what we do is we're saying if if the first is null, then the last is null. Okay. And that's what we keep inside there. Um, and we use an else statement. Else we say our trail current. And normally it's a, like a dot link. Okay equals the current link and we say if our current equals last then our last equals trail current And we delete our current. Then we set our current to the trail current link. So 
So we can step out of our else statement and we can step out of this if uh, current info statement and we can go to another, the next line and we say else I want to just keep that in line there else our trail current equals our current and our current equals our current link And so that would be the end of our, our while statement. And this would be the end of our delete all statement. And so that is what they've basically asked you for in question 15 of the October November 2022 COS 2611 um, exam paper. Thank you for watching. I hope this has been helpful and informative and all the best with COS 2611. Thanks and goodbye.